my way of review at the risk of redundancy, but I am going to add one little item that I have not discussed before. First of all, to review, we all have heard the phrase, how you say it is more important than what you say. That has to do with delivery. The only purpose of the delivery is to keep the audience interested enough to listen to what you have to say. As we've all discussed, delivery starts with volume to be heard, articulation to be understood, eye contact to connect, gestures to enhance, and then, of course, the pitch and pace, the vocal variety. What I want to review today is, again, the pause. The pause, as we all know, has to do with creating a highlight for the message, a pause before, after, or both before and after an important point. It highlights the point. The one thing I want to discuss briefly about the pause is something that I forgot to include in my last ed tip. It was the one thing I wanted to include, and somehow the mind got in the way. And that is this. There is nothing that will keep an audience interested like suspense. If you can put a little bit of suspense into your speech, the audience will listen and be interested. And that is where the pause comes in. For example, and then disaster struck. The unthinkable happened. Pause. The audience wonders, what? And then you tell them. He forgot where he was in his speech. That is an effective use of the pause to create suspense. Don't force suspense into your speech, but when you are writing your speech and reviewing it for the fifth or sixth time, Look for a place where you might want to create a little bit of suspense just to keep the audience wondering, what is he going to say next? What is this about? That's where the pause comes in and is most effective. Thank you.